woman in the world at the time was Judith Denage from Holland. Judith was a butterflyer at the Mexico City Olympics. I knew of her and her great reputation. Judith was uh, around 6'1", 182 pounds. 6'1", 185 pounds. 6'1", 187 pounds. Call me crazy, to me she looked a little more like a tight end than a swimmer. And she came swaggering across the beach. And of course, the beach didn't tremble, but uh, it, it just, you know, you had that impression as she walked. I know the beach isn't trembling when she walks. It just seems that way. <laughs> and she got up to me and took an index finger and jabbed it on the grease on my chest with every syllable. I was so intimidated by her, I just stood there and took it. I had a bruise this big for a month. She said, I hear you're a very good swimmer. Well, you're not going to beat me. And she went swaggering off. And now, I know you won't believe me, but when she walked with those thunderous thighs of hers, I can tell you the beach did tremble just a little as she walked. And the gun went off, and I went swearing in Arabic like all the Egyptians. And I got in there, and it was a cold, long day. But I started getting signals. As I said, you can't touch the boat, but you come close to get your food and, you know, get signals from your team. And they're telling me that Marwan Ghazawi has dropped out, and I've passed Claudio Plitt from Argentina. And I finished in 37 hours, 38 minutes. 37 hours and 38 minutes oh. across Lake Ontario. And I finished third among the men that day, and Judith Denage announced her retirement that night. <laughs> so, you know, you don't want to kick someone out of the sport altogether, but it is an empowering feeling. You know, we athletes like to say we're sporting and we want everybody to, you know, be in it, but to shove somebody out of the sport altogether, it's, that's heady. It's heady stuff. Most athletes tell you, you know, I, I, I'm noble, I, I don't want to compete unless the full field is there. They don't really mean that. They, 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 can't, they can't wait to shove people into retirement. <laughs> Judith Denige announced her retirement from the entire sport.